Hello fellow gamers, I am your host Brent Justice, welcome to my gaming channel Justice Gaming and I am in Far Cry New Dawn once again to continue the storyline. It's been about a week since the I published the last video, so give me a moment as I reacclimate back into the game here after playing it a week ago. And uh, there are a couple things I want to say. I've gotten some very good responses in my comments section on YouTube, so thank you all for comments provided. Uh, Donald King has given me some great advice and things that I did not know, but I kind of thought I knew, but I didn't know right. So huh, let me explain. One of those things is the ethanol trucks. I kind of knew that they're important, but I didn't understand how they were important. I thought you had to blow them up because I was thinking along the lines of Far Cry 5 where there were trucks you had to blow up when you saw them and that helped. But in this game, it's different. Instead, you need to hijack the ethanol trucks. Try to kill the driver and drive the ethanol trucks back to an outpost. That will get you ethanol. So thank you, Donald King, for that advice. I get it now. I understand how that works, and I did not before. So that means instead of blowing up the ethanol trucks, I need to try to disable the driver and then take over the truck and drive it back to one of my outposts. Boom. That's how I can get more ethanol. So that's one way there. So I will do that when I see those trucks. I will try that. It's going to be tricky because you have to take out the driver, but not the whole truck. So that can be a little tricky. So anyway, I will try that. Um, another piece of information I learned is... Uh, there was, uh, you know, I'm drawing a blank right now. There was something else. I'm sure it will come to me as uh, we continue the game. I know there was one bit more of information. Oh, oh, I know what it was. It was about the new Eden's gift. The uh, stuff that I have now under my perks. This was available, and thank you for letting me know once again in the comments. This is available because I did the john seed mission that gave me those abilities so that's how i got them so basically i just need to yeah unlock them unlock the ones i want and i can use these new abilities um i think that one i'm going to go for is was ghost wasn't it oh i've got ghost so hold t to become or c I've, i mean to become much harder to detect by humans. So I've already got Ghost. Um, I guess... Hmm... Maybe Wrath or Leap of Faith next. Maybe Wrath. These you actually have to activate with a, a button though. So we'll see. That one's Y. Yeah, maybe we'll try it. Wrath maybe next. We'll see. I don't know. Uh, leaping high, much higher, could be beneficial also. And then, of course, I can continue to upgrade these things as I need. I can just keep upgrading them. I don't know how many times, but I'll do that. So I've got four perk points right now. I think I'll just save them up and buy some of these Eden gift things because they're new abilities that I don't have. So that could be interesting. So that's what I'll do there. I also want to give one more shout out to a special commentator in a YouTube video of mine. An old buddy of mine, an old chum, an old friend from a long time ago has found me through these videos. <laughs> and I am so thankful for that. Pray521, hello and welcome. Uh, yeah, an old friend of mine uh, from just way back in the day and uh, very, very special to me. A good friend online friend and he found me through these videos and uh, that was that is really cool so pray 521 hello and welcome let's uh, see if I need anything what I'm going to do today uh, let me see about if there's any more upgrading I can do to something, let's see, where do I go for that here? I go here, and I'm at epic level weapons now, so I've got maxed out quality of weapons. And of course, this is the one that I use the most. I can upgrade it. No, I can't upgrade it. It needs ethanol, it needs 
circuit board, so I cannot upgrade it right now. I can't upgrade this either. It needs circuit boards. And then I think I'm... I do, I do have this. I can't upgrade it either. Pretty much have all the weapons that I want to use. I just need more crafting materials to upgrade. Crafting materials is really the big thing that you need. And I know that for my home base, I still have these three down here to upgrade. And I just need a lot more ethanol. Now, I did find one thing out. Another little thing before we continue on here. There are only ten outposts in Far Cry New Dawn. So I do have all the outposts. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So I do have all the outposts. There literally are no more outposts. This is it to deal with in Far Cry New Dawn. So the only way to get like a ton of ethanol, I almost said alcohol, <laughs> not alcohol, ethanol, a ton, uh, a w the only way to get a ton of ethanol is going to be to continue to um, scavenge these outposts that I already have. That's the only way. And I do have all of them at level 2 right now. So I guess I'm going to have to do once more. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 8 more that I can get to level 3. It's going to be difficult. It's going to be hard. Maybe with Ghost it'll be a little easier so I can sneak up to the alarms. That was my thinking on that. But it's going to be necessary if I want the ethanol. It's just the way it is. End of story. Okay. But today, what we're going to do... We're actually going to do a main storyline mission first. I'm going to do inside job. This one's been on, on the uh, docket for a while. It is a level 3 difficulty job. We need to talk to Erwin. Infiltrate the Highwaymen Bullet Farm to gain, gain intel. So we're going to do this main mission. Then, after this main mission, I'm probably going to spend the rest of my gameplay time doing grinding of materials. Outposts and expeditions. Probably just outposts first because I need the ethanol. I wanted to get all the outposts to level 3. I know I said I was going to like totally try to avoid that in my gameplay. It is unavoidable. I have to scavenge the outposts. End of story. So, today's gameplay. That's what we're going to do. Main mission right now. Do this mission first. And then the rest of the video will be just scavenging outposts. So, so I'll let you know when we get to that part. But it's necessary. I've got to do it. And I'm actually going to walk all the way. I know this is very far away where I'm headed right now. Let's look to the map. Yeah, this is extremely far away from where I'm at. But the reason why I'm walking, I want to see if I can find some of those ethanol trucks. If I can get a few to some outposts, I want to see how much ethanol they give me. Because I don't know the quantity that they give you. But I would love to get some to some outposts. So that's the deal. We're going to walk to our goal, main mission. Along the way, we're going to look for ethanol trucks, drive them to outposts if I can, do this main mission. After main mission, I'm going to grind outposts until I get tired of it. <laughs> That's going to be today's video. But at least we'll make some progress on the main mission today. And by the way, I am 73% of the main storyline. 73% of the main storyline. So I'm actually making pretty good progress on the main storyline. Like, really good progress. But yeah, I know that this is just really far away. And I'm taking my time. I'm going to find some methanol trucks. That is very important. And in fact, I think I have one now.
Okay, that's how you do this. I heard something. Now I need to take it safely. I don't want to fast travel there. I think I have to actually like drive the truck there. I think I just ran over a person. I am so sorry about that. And I think I have auto repair so that my truck automatically repairs itself when I get in it. I'm just driving right past these bad guys. I see them, but I can't stop to take care of it. I need to get this thing to where it's going. I suppose that's one of the dangers is that they could they could um, try to blow it up on me just by shooting at it. But I don't want to stop. I just feel that's going to be even worse. Run over some pigs, no problem. It's pretty far to drive to get this to one of the outposts though, I'll tell you that. There's some enemies. Did I do it? Did I deliver it? Awesome. Ethanol times 75. Okay. Well, now I know how to do that. Now I'm up to 129. So thank you. Uh, whoa, hello. You followed me all the way here. So thank you for that information, Donald King. I appreciate that. That is definitely one way to get some ethanol. I can also see that I'm probably going to need armor piercing. These enemies are getting really tough. And if I want to get through those trucks, I need to use, uh, I need to use something more intense. Put a waypoint on it too, so I can... Got to be careful though. I don't have a ton of that ammo. An ammo upgrade for for uh, piercing ammo might actually be worth it in the perks. So I don't have as much piercing ammo, and I believe I can upgrade my type of ammo. Right? No, well, maybe not. More heavy ammo. More light ammo more throwables. Maybe more light ammo would do it. That would take all of my stuff though. Uh, we'll wait and see. Still never did figure out what these wolf guys are. Somebody let me know the little icon with the wolf over their head. What does that indicate? They definitely run from you. They try to get away. So why are they important? They don't give you anything special. Dang, okay, these guys are like hiding and stuff. Oh, 
I actually think I want to upgrade damage because this is uh, it's not doing as much damage the first time. Dang. And these guys are like really heavily armored. Holy snikes. Okay, we got a we got a got something going on over here. These guys are getting harder and harder to take care of. Supply drop, hold on. Ah, he's so far away. Too far away. Let's get this uh, supply drop, though. Yeah, these guys are getting harder and harder to take out. I'll tell you what. I, I think I will need to upgrade the damage on this thing, like, a lot. <laughs> Gonna land in the water. I uh, see a sniper uh, laser. Yeah, these guys are just really getting harder to take out. Whew, okay. What's all this about? Bear! Ah, bear! Bad guy! I can't win! I'm wasting my ammo here. My gosh. Really encountering a bunch of resistance. Oh good, a demon fish. That's just what I need. My goodness, I'm encountering a lot of resistance. Let's hurry up and try to get to this... Uh, what? I mean, I can't win. There's always something after me. I hear things roaring. I uh, there's a must be a yeti up here. What in the world is going on? I'm down on ammo again. Too much craziness. Is that a... what kind of truck is that? Some kind of truck. It's... It's so far away. Oh, I got him. Ah, and there's nobody in it. Well, that was pointless. What are they shooting at? These guys are so armored up.
Wow. Maybe walking there wasn't such a good idea. I'm just using up all my ammo trying to get there. I don't like that. Let's try this. Okay, guys. Well, I definitely interrupted them. Not sure it was worth that ammo, though. Not sure it was worth all that ammo. So, yeah, that's interesting. We're getting closer to where we need to get to. Still quite a distance though. <laughs> Haven't seen any more ethanol trucks. I think maybe I was reading also that I think that the ethanol trucks they come by your outpost like if you wait long enough by your outpost there will be some that drive by so maybe I should try that technique also okay I see bad guys there I'm not even gonna mess with them right now I just don't want to don't want to waste my ammo and I hear a beast wait here's a truck is this a what kind of truck is that a loot oh come on I think it's a loot truck. Hey, now. No, interact. I don't know. Oh yeah, components. I accidentally hit C. At least now I see how it works. How many... Yeah, I had to run away. <laughs> I had to run away. That's right. Okay. And there's a cat. Yeah, you two fight. Fight it out. I am now taking a vehicle because ah, uh, things are crazy in this world. I'm just going to take a vehicle there. <laughs> Screw all of that. Nope, not going to mess with it. I'm never going to get this mission done if I don't get there. That, not an ethanol truck, so I'm not going to worry about it. Not an ethanol truck. Not going to worry about it.
I'm only gonna stop for um, ethanol trucks. I know there's somebody right behind me. Oh, and I found a new area. I'll come back to it. I want to get the mission started. I haven't even started the mission yet. <laughs> what? A sniper? You're kidding me. There's a truck following me. Great. But I really want to get this mission started. <laughs> That's all I want to do. I guess I should have not walked. Come on. Get Let's... ready for pain. Uh, you get ready for pain. There. That wasn't too bad. <laughs> He followed me all the way here to die. Not an ethanol truck. Not stopping, not stopping. Might have to stop. Might have to stop. Ouch. 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 Uh, okay, I'm on fire. Everything's on fire. Holy crap, they are hitting hard. They are hitting so hard. You know what? I'm leaving all that behind and I'm going around. I'm just not going to deal with it. I'm not going to deal with it. Get me out of here. Okay. Why are they coming in such large numbers now? Oh, I'm quitting. Okay, I'm not quitting. They're not going to let me quit. I got the high ground now. Nope, they have a rocket launcher. What in the... Why is this so getting difficult now? Oh, I mean, these enemies are at, like, magnificent level. Like, what the heck? I can't get away from them. They are really angry. I'm just not going to deal with it. I'm sorry. I ain't dealing with it. I think I've used up all my throwables. I have badgers attacking me. Yes, I used up all my Molotovs. Oh boy, I had to get off the main roads. So that was just unbelievable. All I want to do is get to the mission. It's been 30 minutes and I haven't even started the mission I was going to start when I started this video. Uh, sorry about that. I was hoping to get more ethanol trucks. I think what I need to do though is I need to stay around my outposts. And I believe the ethanol trucks will like come around those areas. So I think I'll try that later, but let's uh, let's get this mission started. That's what I actually wanted to do was to start this mission. And now there's gunfire somewhere around me. That's great. Yeah, my ammo is so low on this. This is not where I wanted to be right now. I should have just fast traveled close to this area, but no, I had to go looking for ethanol trucks because I'm special. <laughs> well, I learned my lesson. Not doing that again.
Yeah, this was just way too far away. I should have just fast traveled. Sorry about that, guys. 30 minutes of wasted video. Hate that. But I'm not the kind of person that's going to delete the video. You're going to see everything and feel my disappointing playthrough. <laughs> You're going to feel what I... Oh, that's a big, that's a big drop-off. You're going to feel what I had to feel. Oh my gosh, there's so many. I'm out. I can't do it. I can't handle it. Don't want to handle it. Are they coming my way? All right, I'm just running away <laughs> fast as possible. We're finally here. I took the absolute longest route you could ever take. All right, let's see what we have to do here. Where am I, by the way? I'm here. I'm looking toward this compound here. I think this was the prison in Far Cry 5. I think. So fucking what? Yeah, it is. You want the twins, right? You want to get close enough to count the nose hairs? Well, I got a way to do that. Well, normally, I just walk you up and introduce you to the twins straight off. But I'm on the outs with them right now. Told them they were fucking up and they got all huffy. It's a whole thing. That's not important. What's important is that now, the twins are all over this guy Frank. Like he's their best friend or something. They even made him the fucking warden of the prison. You believe that? Well, they know me and him don't get along. He's such a dick. Well, what it is is, Lou has a thing for me. And she wants to make me jealous, okay? Now, why else would they even talk to that asshole? So the number one part of the plan is you got to kill Frank. Kill Frank. Here's how we do it. He's the prison warden, right? So I take you to the prison as a prisoner. That gets you close to Frank and you just fucking take him out. Take that motherfucker out. Golly. I'll explain the rest of the plan on the way. Trust me, it's sure fire. Just stash your gear here. The prisoners don't got weapons. So I got to truck and I'll drive you in. Take him out with my bare fists. If you say so. Not sure I like this idea. Also, it's not letting me stash my weapons. There we go. Okay, well, at least we're finally on the main hey, mission. What do you know? Orange is your color. Hop in the back. Let's go. So Let's how see how this works. Close to the twins, right? Uh, the demolition derby's coming up. Winner of the Derby gets invited to the fancy ass dinner with all the highwaymen bigwigs. Win the Derby, and you got an express ticket to the twins' personal space. The problem is, the Derby's got all the drivers they need. We gotta open up a spot in the lineup. Well, guess what? Frank's all set to drive in the Derby. That's right. You see the genius of the plan? You take Frank out, and boom! Suddenly the Derby's a driver short. So happens, I know a guy who's tight with a gal. Anyway. I can get you that spot on the derby. So I'm going to have to win a derby now. I'm not sure uh, if I'm good good at that, but we'll see. First, I got to take out Frank, though. That's going to be difficult. I guess without any weapons, you'll have to improvise a way to kill that motherfucker. I'll let you work out the details. <laughs> Imagine that, little fucker in his garbage truck. Hope you got something good in the truck bed there, little fucker. Hope it's worth a fucking while. The hell you want, little fucker? Hey, nice to see you too. Jeez. I got a prisoner with me. What do you think? Mm. It's your ass in the weeds if they're a problem. Bring him in. Don't die, huh? So that means I'm probably going to die. Oh, and there's uh, gears here. Six gears. So I guess after I kill everybody, I need to get the gears. 
obviously that means I'm going to be able to come back and loot the place. So I will just have to wait and see what happens here. By the way, again, visuals looking great in the game. Looking real good. Nice and shiny. Figure out how to take out Frank, huh? This way, Step Steal one of their weapons. Oh, there's a locker. There's stuff in there. I can see it. We're going to come back in here and loot it. Okay, we are in the prison. I remember this place. That's it, huh? Assemble. Assemble bullets that I'm going to use to kill everybody with, maybe. Well, I can't go outside my zone. How many bullets do I have to assemble? There they are. How do I get out of here? Hey, sir, Waffle. Make sure she isn't working. Get back to it. Workbench one, you're done for the day. Head to the yard, keep your hands to yourself. That means you too, Chud Waffle. Yeah. The yard, huh? Hello, how do I get free of this? Find a way to kill Frank. Well, I'm trying. Uh, so they allow us some, a little bit of freedom out here. Okay, if I hold and do that, I kind of like lunge forward. Just practicing because I think I'm going to have to take them out this way. Nobody will talk to me, huh? I finally got my car running again. And then I got caught just driving down the road. They took my car. I've been rotting in here ever since. Mm hmm. Okay. God, I'm so sore. I hope they don't figure out I'm not strong enough to keep this up. Yeah. So we can talk to some people. Not everybody, though. I can climb. Worst part is, I don't even want to escape. They feed us once a day here. Out there, I didn't have much of anything. Apparently there is somebody I specifically need to talk to. But before I do, let's just talk to everybody else. Just a few 
few more days. A few more days, and I'll try breaking out of here again. Okay, okay. I don't see anybody in the towers. Oh, there's definitely people up there. Not a whole lot. All right, let's see. Let's talk to. I know you. how to get out of here. I know which one has the key back inside. They took my shiv to the restricted zone. I could try and get it, take him out. If my goddamn legs would stop shaking. If I had the guts. Take the shiv. Take the key to the factory. Yeah. Take, take. Do I need to sneak? I wonder if I still have my ghost ability. I do. That's gonna work. That's gonna work. Thank goodness for that uh, new ghost ability I have with the uh, Eden's Gift. I just need to wait for it to recharge and I should be able to use it again. Okay, that is so cool. He shouldn't see me if I do ghost, right? He might see the door open, but he shouldn't see me, right? Also, there's something to break right there to bring that ladder down. It's locked. Let's wait for that to recharge. I could go up on the roof. Up on the rooftop. Click, click, click. Down through the chimney comes me. I'm going to wait for my thing to recharge and I'm going to ghost and I'm going to go up to the roof and pop down. I think that's the way to do, to, the easiest thing to do here. Hopefully they won't see me. I don't know, right, being that close, if they will be able to see me or not, to be honest with you, but we'll find out real quick. Okay, they saw me. <laughs> I got my answer. I got my answer. Yeah, okay, okay. That was fun. I, I didn't realize there was a person in there. So next time... I will take them out. I will do a takedown. Oh, wait a minute. I think I actually succeeded. Sneak inside to the rooftop. Oh, wait a minute. <laughs> okay, well, never mind. Well, let me tell you what my plan was going to be. Because I guess I already got the stuff. My plan was going to be that I was going to... Uh, sneak in here. Or like I just did with Ghost, because obviously I was able to easily get in that way. Then I was going to take use a takedown on the person inside that room, and then get what I need and come back out. And then nobody should be the wiser, and I should be okay. But the mission already progressed because I got the stuff. Even though I died, I already got the thing I needed to continue to the next thing, so... So far, nobody saw me. I don't know to the extent that the ghost hides you. Let me read it real quick. 
let's see what it says temporarily become much harder to detect so you just become harder to detect you don't become like completely invisible it's not an invisibility cloak it's just you're harder to detect I'm gonna wait for it to recharge Alright, I'm in it now. Can I save? Because I'm in a precarious position. I can't save. Person is up there. New factory scabs this month, a uh, fat nugget. <laughs> Farts when nervous, so like all the time. Chode splicer doesn't like getting kicked in the chode. This guy, wow, he's got a wafer. Uh, that's me, ch uh, chud waffle, dumb face, weird body, just a chud waffle. The rest coming back next time. So they have nicknames for everybody. And that's going to open the door for me. I do have a weapon now, but if I if I set it off, people are going to hear it. So I'll try takedowns most of the time. Let me out. Can I go back and get the loot that was in here? believe I can sneak inside up to the rooftop I hate sneak missions I just really do they're not my type of thing y'all know me I like to go in and blow things up and just shoot my way to the top but right now I have to do this a little delicately or else I die Okay, I'm going to take this person above me out. Yeah, this ghost is pretty darn nice. It's not a full cloak. But it's harder to detect. I could have also come up here this way.
Man, I want to go hang out on the roof with Frank. I bet you can see all the scabs from up there all sitting ready, but no. So Frank is on the roof. Just getting a good lay of the land. I could go that way. Wonder what is this way. Locked anyway. Oh, I found gears. I'll probably come back and just kill everybody and get all the gears next time. I've obviously missed a lot. There's people up there. Ah, oh, shoot. How am I going to get this guy that's on the roof on the other side? Shoot, if he comes over here, he's going to see me. I'm going to wait till he goes back inside. Got to wait till he goes back inside. Please go back inside, whoever you are. Can I climb up here? Darn it, I cannot climb up there. Oh, there's stairs, okay. Oh, there's a guy right there, there's a guy right there. All right, I'll wait for him to go back in. That's all I can do, I'm gonna go up there, then I'll ghost and go up the stairs. Is this guy gonna go back in? I gotta wait for the guy uh, with the sniper up there to go back inside. Go back inside, fella. We don't need you out here. This guy's gonna stay turned around so he shouldn't see me. Especially if I use ghost. Okay, he's gonna go back in. That wasn't Frank. I thought that was going to be Frank right up here when I came up to the roof. It was not. What's this enter the back of Irwin's truck? Hold on. Got a new thing. Enter the back of Irwin's truck. I'm going to try it. If I don't get seen. <laughs> you like 
to play it loud and proud. Shoot. Slick, Darn. Get caught in this shit storm. Meet you down the road once you get out. Dang. Crap. Man, I buggered that up. Crap, 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 crap. Okay, I was totally cornered. Totally cornered. Oh man, I messed up that optional. I wanted to do that. Maybe I'll still have the option if I come back now after dying. Let's find out. That was pretty tough. Yeah, that shotgun was not the right thing there for that. Oh, I still have an option to do this. Okay, well, I did it that way then. Sure. Fine. Let's go with it. <laughs> That's a better option. So dying saved me, ultimately. <laughs> dying let me reset it. Oh, there's an ethanol truck. I need it. I need you. I need you, ethanol truck. Holy shit, Slick. You're like a ghost in the night up here. I knew you were the one for the job. Just popped in there like a fart on the breeze and got everything we need. Now it remains to be fucking seen if you can drive worth a damn. What's he shooting at? Watch where you're going, man. I'm gonna drive off a cliff. Ran into an animal, dude. You're running into everything out there. Alright, we'll talk about this mission once we, uh, like, get out of the truck here and end it. But, yeah. I'll just tell you straight up, I don't like stealthy missions. You know, I'm not that kind of player. I don't like that kind of stuff. I like to go in and shoot everybody in the head and get it done. <laughs> anyway. Why'd he stop? Use the workbench. I cannot overstate how much I wanted Frank to die. Thank you. Can't believe that idiot thought he could drive in the derby. I could drive in the derby. I could run the derby. I know more about cars than any of them. I once built a car out of nothing but a kitchen sink. That spot in the derby is yours now. And that's gonna get you up close and personal with Mickey and Lou. All I gotta do is finagle you a halfway decent set of wheels and you're good to go. Look, we don't want to be seen hanging around together. So you gotta move on out of here. Now don't worry. I'll be in touch real soon. Alright, so that's gonna progress the story so that we can 
get in the derby but that was a main storyline mission there that we completed today I know it's been an hour now in the video um, prisoner outfit unlocked main mission completed supply drop in a place where I can loot stuff but let me get this supply drop first oh and here's a workbench and I've got rot gut pass all right so there's some things to do and we'll talk about that in just a second you oh crap you know I got to go after this supply drop you know that's where I'm headed Let's re-equip all my stuff if it'll let me here. Do I need to like actually like really re-equip everything? I guess I do. I don't need to craft this, I own it. What is this stuff about crafting? I already own it. It reset all my weaponry. Man, what? I shouldn't have to like rebuy this stuff. Upgrade, equip. I want to equip. Yes, I own it. Duh. Where's the equip on this one? I know I own this. I don't want to buy it. I own it. Something screwy. It's making me want to buy it again, but I don't want to buy it. I already own it. It's dumb. That's just dumb. I own that. Uh, where's the other thing that I own? Yeah, I own that. Why don't I own this? Thought I did own that. Really weird because I thought I owned that. So I don't know what's happening there. Okay, but we're all geared up anyway let me look at this place real quick where are we we've got wheels we've got three more wheels to pick up here or gears so yeah let's just talk about that mission real quick um i am not one there's a lot of fighting going on near me i, I, I hear it i know what's happening i'm ignoring it on purpose so i'm not one for stealth missions it's not me uh, but it was pretty all right that wasn't too bad. I'll tell you what came in clutch though. What came in clutch was the ghosting ability from the New Eden ability. Oh, he can come up here. Maybe I shouldn't have ticked him off. I didn't think he could come up on the roof. And then he did. That didn't even kill him. Look at that. That won't even kill him. Alright, I'm going to have to take care of these guys because they're not going to let me do what I need to do.
I swear you you can't do anything in this game because everything starts attacking you all at once. You can't take five minutes to breathe. You just really cannot take five minutes to breathe in this game. Alright, so now what I'm trying to say is, I'm not one for stealth missions, but that one was still pretty good, pretty e easy. But what saved me most in that mission was having that ability, that new Eden ability called Ghost. So if I hadn't have gotten those abilities and all, that would have been a lot more difficult. So I'm very glad I had the new Eden ability. Now, there is a way in here. That saved me and allowed me to get this done. So, yes, thanks to the ghost ability, I was able to get that mission done. There you go, end of story. <laughs> um, I did not... I did not succeed the first time, really, without dying. I did die a couple times. There's more fighting. I, so I did die. I did die a little bit there, and golly. I did die a few times there, but a monstrous boar? Heck no. I think that's what I killed was one of those monstrous creatures. Is that a ethanol truck I see over there or not? I don't think so. That's prison truck, I think. Yeah, so, um... I originally, I guess, did not get the optional because I died. But because I died, it kind of reset me back to a place where I could actually do the optional. So, ultimately, I got the optional done, but technically I didn't get it done the first time. So, there you go. So, I just wanted to say that. I recognize that. So anyway, that's fine and good. It worked and I did that mission. So do we have like a new main mission for us? Probably not at the moment. No, we'll, we'll pick one up, I'm sure. There's a lot more that I wanted to do here though because I don't, I have 206 ethanol. 250, I can upgrade another thing. There was a pla a, pace, a place that we passed. I'll, 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 actually, I can go back to this prison too, but I may not yet. There was a place though that we did pass on the way that had materials that I didn't pick up all the materials on. What was it though? Maybe, uh, maybe this was it. Yeah, this must have been the place. Oh, but here's another place soft cabin and uh, there's three there let's go pick that up real quick so it's been over an hour now and we did get a main mission done so thank goodness for that I want to do just a tad more uh, let's go to where these things are down here I want okay and there's there's the derby thing there's the next main mission, Riding Derby. Level 3 difficulty, that's where we're going to have to go do the Derby race, which uh, again will probably progress the main storyline. But before I do that, there are m more things I want to do. I thought I've been to this place before. Good day to you, sir. Good day to you, sir. Seeing Edeners out in daylight now. Thanks. Help me! Oh, my God, please help! 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 Help
I did help. I killed them all before they got a shot off. Like I said, you can't take five minutes to think in this game. Because everything's out to kill you. Alright, I am looking for gears, however. Ah, there's snakes, too. I knew I should have cut off my finger, scraped it real bad while I was burning up stuff. Now my hand's full. Maybe I can find someone around here who will chop it off. I don't know what to do. So is there stuff inside? I would say so. Come on in. Got everything. Good. Is his finger in here? That's what I want to know. Okay, now we looted that place. All right, let's do a thing. Oh crap, there's something. What? They are just everywhere. Let's go back to this one. Actually, screw that. Let's go to this one, the refinery. I'm going to travel here. I'm going to do a scavenge for, in the, for the rest of this video. We'll just do one scavenge right now. That'll allow me to upgrade one piece of my home base. <laughs> I know I need to do a lot more than that, but it'll help. We'll start there anyway. Make sure I've got enough ammo here. How many perks am I up to? Five perks? What could help me here? I've already got Ghost. I can't get Wrath until eight. So. Okay, let's do level three scavenge on this. This is going to be fun. It's going to be hard, <laughs> actually, not fun. Let me take that back. Fun? No. Hard? Yes. I see one alarm there. There's going to be three alarms. So there's one there. I think I see one in the distance. I don't know if that's one. I don't see the green light on top. There's one there. I'm already being detected. Already being detected. This one's like white out in the white out right out in the open. Hard to see. Hard, hard not to be seen. I want to get around and take out that antenna first. So I'm going to come out wide, swing wide, and come in and take these out one by one. If I can get the alarms out, it's so much easier on me. I mean, I'm going to try. I'm already being detected. I'm already being detected. That one's inside poopy poopy monkey how do I get in you well I'm totally gonna be seen oh my gosh I'm being real quiet. Oh gosh. Uh, 
am I gonna get up there? Wish I could climb through the window. I'm gonna get this person above me. Done. I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. That's it. That's it. Enemy enforcements. Missed every single time. Huh. Yeah, that was a mistake to uh, not get that alarm. Should have called in my buddy. I think it's a little late now, but I should have called in my buddy with the rockets.
Where are they? Where's the last one? I hear them, I don't see them. But they see me. Who's left? Who's left? Okay, that was messy. I didn't get the alarm. So no alarm bonus. That sucks. But I still got enough ethanol to unlock one of the things. That's the important part. All right, got a lot of ethanol. Good, good, good. Let me, because uh, I think, want to. I want to test something out. I think that if I stay around, if I stay around the outpost long enough, I am pretty sure an ethanol truck will drive by somewhere. This is not ag exactly out on the main road, but if I stay around here, I think an ethanol truck comes somewhere close, I think. Close enough that I can get one. That's my theory. Could be wrong, but we're not exactly out on the main road here. So it's not, it's possible that's not true. May need to get to an outpost that's like on a main road or something. All right, well, anyway, let me uplo uh, upload, let me upgrade uh, my expeditions to level three. We'll just go ahead and do that. Oh, and we have enough to do a uh, healing garden. All right, I just need a little bit more and I'll have the entire thing upgraded. I just have cartography left. I only have one left. That is really good. I've only got one more home base thing to upgrade. And I'm going to do it before I do like the next main mission. I want to upgrade my entire home base. Seen the fight. Good shit. Yeah, I don't think an ethanol truck's going to come by this place. It's too not on the main road. Let me go to something that's like on the main road. Well, actually, right here, this is the main road. I'm just not near it. Is this a main road? It's a road. So, would like something come by here? Is this not the proper position? That lines up right there, doesn't it? Does it not? I don't know why it won't align. Maybe I need to be over here. No, wrong button. Ah, yeah. Had to be way back here for that to happen. Prep point. Okay. Uh, so, yeah. Ethanol truck. Where? I don't see one coming by. It's 
This is kind of a main road, or it was a main road at one point. But I see no ethanol trucks coming by, so... That's not an ethanol truck, but I'll take it. Ethanol truck? No ethanol truck. Oh, here's a basket. Let's get... I missed some baskets here. Let's get those while we're right here. Is that it? That's... Is that it? I don't know what it is. No, it's just a... It's just a truck. Not an ethanol truck, just a truck. I didn't want to drive this. Get out. Just want to loot. Okay, let's get the baskets here. We got one, we got two. We got a pack. This place sounds like it's on, it's humming. Missing one pack. Not an ethanol truck. It's a loot truck. I'm gonna let it pass. Unless they don't let me pass. Oh, that'll work. I think I'm missing one basket. I just don't know where. I think this building does have electricity. It sounds like it's on. There it is. Okay, I have looted this place. Okay, got that, got that. I think that's going to be it for today. What's an airdrop? I have a new thing now, don't I? Because I have, oh yeah, wait a minute, home base. Uh, unlocks airdrop to locations, liberated outpost emperor. Ooh, 
I can have airdrops come into my outposts? I have to try this. I have to try this. If I can get ethanol just by doing that, that could be a thing. Wait a minute now. Have I just discovered something? What is... Uh, is that a supply drop or... Uh, what's an airdrop? Is an airdrop different than a supply drop? I um, don't know. What's All right. We got to try it. How did I do this before? Oh, does that just drop me there? So, I, so it's basically fast travel, except I'm dropping in. Oh, okay. So I can basically fly to wherever I need to go. Well, okay, I get it. I can uh, dr airdrop in, fly in, okay. I understand. I don't need that right this second, but at least I know I can do that now. That's cool. All right, I figured something out. So my healing garden is upgraded. You're a hero and a diplomat now. Everything except cartography is like upgraded all the way. Expeditions are upgraded. I literally only have cartography. You and me, we make good partners, huh? All right, so I think I know what I'm going to do. I do have a main mission story quest to do, but I'm actually going to, in the next video, the first thing I'm going to do is take over another outpost, which should give me enough ethanol, or if not, two outposts. Um, do a level three on two outposts should give me enough ethanol to upgrade my home base completely. I'll be able to get level three on cartography and then everything will be upgraded. All my facilities will be upgraded. So then after that's done, after the, all those facilities are upgraded, then I will go do the main mission. So that's what I'm going to do in the next video. But I've done a lot in this video. We got a main mission done. We got two things on my home base upgraded. I figured out how to do ethanol trucks finally. <laughs> so we're making progress. It's been an hour and a half, so I'm going to call it for today. Thank you all for watching. If you like what you see here, consider subscribing to the channel and giving the video a like. Thank you for watching and stay tuned for the next one.